So, how'd it go? Well... <clears throat> See, at so the tournament, you're really mad. Not so good. Uh, I was a little off my game. I made it past the preliminaries, but I don't, you know, I'm kind of nervous for the actual tournament. Well, it's not the championships yet. Yeah, but it's tomorrow. I don't have time to improve it by then. Nick, there's something I need to tell you, but not here. We should head back to the apartment. Yeah, we should get back anyway. We love Jake, the Encino girls. Who's Encino girl? You know, that girl that's been in my car for a while? She started dripping and stuff, so we moved her into the bathtub. Okay, I guess we better get back then. All sorts of innocent being there, all wet and shit. So, how's she doing? <sighs> well, um... My observations, man, she seems to be moving around just a little bit, but, uh, other than that, just a slow progress. I mean, I, she hasn't really talking much, though. I mean, I don't even know if she's capable of, of speech. I mean, hell, I don't even know if she's capable of, like, you know, functioning properly in today's society. Well, we really have no choice. I, that, really, it's the responsibility of ourselves to get her integrated back into our culture. Good point. So, how did she survive being frozen solid in your car? Well, you know, I, uh, I came up with an actual theory, but kind of forgot it, so I'm just going to go with magic. What do you mean, magic? Dude, you may not know this. Your car is evil as shit. It's true. Deal with it. Yeah. Uh-huh. Well, then, how did she freeze solid in the first place? Well... It all started. What are you talking about? You didn't have long hair four weeks ago. Yeah, dude. You went back to high school. Oh, yeah. So anyway, I just needed to get out of the house because I couldn't take Nick's stuff anymore. And at that time, it was when I needed to hang out with some people just to vent. So, you know, one thing led to another. We were on our way home. <laughs> So much. I mean, I mean, I like the rat, and yeah, the rat bit me, and the rat had a weird smell to it. But I don't think there's anything wrong. I mean, rats do that all the time. There's nothing overly creepy about it. I mean, all animals have kind of a smell to them. Anyway, so anyway, let's see here. Hey, how you doing? Are you all right? Wow, she frozen solid. Man, that's gonna be hard to take care of. Hmm. Better come up with a plan on this. Wait a minute. I'd probably be blamed for that now, wouldn't I? Let's see. She doesn't seem that bad. I'm sure she'll be fine till spring. So then I came inside, and I tried to call for help, but Nick quarantined me. <laughs> it took like four hours before I actually got you in the damn quarantine. You distracted me. Riff, you are a horrible person. No, I... Yeah, I am. <laughs> well, that aside, what do we do now, guys? Well, Nick and I need to begin training. Ooh, and we need to integrate her back into society. You're right. All right, let's get to it. Sounds good. All right.